Welcome to another Simple Engineering Snippet. In this instructional video, we work a fluid mechanics example involving fluid statics. I hope you find it useful. A container contains three fluids, each with a distinctly different density. The top layer is pressurized air, the middle layer is gasoline, the bottom layer is glycerin. Two standpipes are connected as shown, one connected to the gasoline layer and the other to the glycerin layer. The depth for each fluid layer is provided. The air is pressurized to 1500 pascals. Let's label point alpha to be the at the top of the air layer, point bravo at the top of the standpipe connected to the gasoline, and finally point charlie at the top of the standpipe connected to the glycerin. Note that points bravo and charlie are exposed to atmospheric pressure at zero pascals gauge. The specific weight or weight density of each fluid is provided. Our goal is to determine the height to the top of each standpipe reference from the bottom of the tank. Let's label point delta as the bottom of the tank. Using fluid statics, let's build an expression for the pressure at point delta along the path from alpha to delta as shown. Now let's do the same but follow the path from point charlie to point delta. Now we equate the two expressions for the pressure at point delta and solve for the unknown, the elevation at point charlie. Subbing in the values and the units, we obtain that the elevation of point charlie is 1.93 meters. Now let's repeat the process. We will still use the equation for the pressure at point delta that was obtained along the path from point alpha to delta. We will equate that to an expression for the pressure at point delta obtained along the path from point bravo to delta. Once again, we equate the two expressions for the pressure at point delta and solve for the unknown. In this case, the unknown is the elevation of point bravo. Subbing in the values and units, we obtain that the elevation at Point Bravo is 2.73 meters. I hope you found this instructional snippet useful. If so, then please like and subscribe. Thanks, and have a great day.